This video documents the process and results of concrete that's been polished with and without the use of water. The first step for this slab is to remove the existing polish. Though not typical for the process to start with a polished slab, the surface grinding done using an 80 grit metal uniformly processes the floor. Fine sand and water are used to keep the diamond tool sharp and freely cutting. Once complete, a hybrid step, 100 grit copper in this case, is used to remove the 80 grit metal scratches. Following the hybrid pad, a 200 resin bond diamond is passed over the area. After the 200, a 400 grit resin pad smooths the surface further. Following the 400, an 800 grit resin pad produces the shine and clarity. The opposite side starts with the same 100 grit copper hybrid, but it's run wet. The water acts as a cutting lubricant to cool the tools and allow uniform scratch removal and replacement. After wet vacuuming and subsequent drying time, the remaining steps are done the same as the first process. 200 grit resin, 400 grit resin, eight hundred grit resin. The whole area is covered by an eighteen hundred grit resin. The floor looks about the same, but the scratches are indicative of ineffective processing by the dry hybrid step. Wet cutting is the messiest part of this polishing process, but the wet waste is justified by the result. And that's about it. The process and results of concrete that's been polished with and without the use of water.